Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. So I wanted to jump on really quick this morning and talk about red teaming offensive security training. I get a lot of people messaging me asking where to start to become a red teamer, a pen tester, etc. So before we get into the video, if you guys are new to the channel, welcome. Please like, subscribe, and share. And if you're returning, let's have some fun. All right, so I'm just going to make this quick and simple. And what I would do, I went out to the interwebs and searched a little bit, but I find that Try Hack Me has the best, you know, entry point to learn. The path is super easy to digest. So what we can do is just go to tryhackme.com. And once we go to tryhackme.com, I do have an account. So I have a, a paid account. So let's see how much of it is free. So you can see and how much of it you have to be like a VIP member, which is very, very reasonably priced. You know, you can afford it. If you have a job, you can afford, I think it's like 10 bucks a month. So it's not bad at all. All right, so if we go to learn up here on the top here, you have dashboard and learn. There's different paths, right? There's practice that you can go ahead and practice. You can search, say for example, you just wanna search something like for example, intro to offensive security. You can click on this and you can get a little intro to offensive security. I think I did a video on this, but let's go back to learn here. So we have different paths, right? And we can go to you know modules, we can go to networks, etc. So let's stick on the topic of today, red teaming and offensive security. So here we have a red teaming uh, path right here. Learn the skills to become a red team operator. So if we click on here, and I wanna go into some other ones too, that you can become a red teamer and it's a certification. It's the CR, CRTP certification. So, but we'll get into this in a second. This is Certified Red Team Professional, but we'll get into that one in a moment, okay? So if we come back to Try Hack Me, the aim of this path, the, this pathway is to show how to emulate, you know, adversary attacks, et cetera, in complex networks and environments. So we have red teaming, uh, red team fundamentals. I went through a few here. As you can see, the red team fundamentals, red team engagements, and next is like red team threat intel, Red Team OpSec, Intro to C2, which is a command and controls. So that's the first, uh, first option, right? The first choice or the first section or whatever. So once you complete all of these, you will get a little certificate. Obviously, I'm 7% through here. And then you have initial access, and you can go through here, Red Team Recon, Weaponization, Password Attacks, Phishing, etc. Right? So then we have... Host compromise, host invasion, network security invasion, and compromise in AD. I'm gonna I'm gonna do I'm gonna do some stuff with Kevtech. Um, you probably know him. He, he's an awesome guy. He has a cool YouTube channel. If you're learning Active Directory server help desk, and he's working for a company now that he's uh, monitoring Active Directory and all that good stuff. So he you know hit me up and we wanted to talk about the compromise in AD together. So we'll go through all of these probably modules and this will be fun. Okay. So if we go to post compromise, we can see, you know, the lay of the land, enumeration, uh, Windows privask, local persistence, lateral movement, and data exfiltration, right? So after we're done with this, we can move on to the section four, host invasions, right? So we can see, you know, the... There's a lot of information to digest. What I would recommend is do one section at a time, take some notes, understand the concept and what you're doing and what you're learning, right? So don't just you know, do it and then jump to the next, like really understand what these topics are about, okay? So this looks like a fun you know, host invasion. That's always fun, right? Um, then we have network security invasion, firewall, sandboxing, et cetera, network security. And then we have like the compromised AD, like I said, AD basics, breaching AD, uh, enumerating AD, lateral movement, uh, pivoting, ex exploiting AD, et cetera, et cetera, right? So now you complete all this, you get a fancy certificate, 
right? So if you want to take it to the next step, before we actually get into the certification, we can, we can go back to learn. And then we have either junior pen tester, you can do this, or you can come down to offensive, uh, offensive pen testing. So offensive pen testing is another, you know, offensive security track on TriHackMe, where I would definitely recommend if you're interested in this. I did a few, you know, there's a lot to it. You know, there's some boxes here. They're getting started, advanced exploitation. So there's some, uh, there's some rooms here, like Steel Mountain, Alfred, Hack Park, whatever, blah, blah, blah. So, and you can see buffer overflow. AD stuff is probably similar to the other one. And extra credit, I guess, hacking with PowerShell, Corp, Mr. Robot, and Retro. So these are probably some extra credit stuff. But yeah, once you, you know, complete this, you get a little certificate as well, I assume. I'm only 1%, so I have a long way to go. All right, so this is the stuff from TryHackMe. And the reason why I recommend TryHackMe because it's very beginner, user-friendly. They don't just throw you in the weeds and say, you know, go for it. So if you actually click on something, say, for example, this box of vulnerability, okay? So if you get stuck, there's a, actually, there's a walkthrough right here. I've never even seen that. So you can start the machine and say, for example, you know, we get the Nmap commands, right? You can get the flags here, what they mean, the description. So, that, you know, you have the little cheat sheet and then they have questions. Some people like this, some people don't. But if you're a beginner, this will help you because you could say, okay, scan the box, how many ports are open, right? So we can say, okay, I, I never scanned a box before. So now I wanna learn how to use Nmap against this box and it's three ports open you know, port 80, 21, and 22, for example. And then we can actually just put in the answer and then we can learn as we go, right? So, you know, these are pretty, pretty, pretty helpful, you know, <clears throat> excuse me. So then locating directories using GoBuster. So this is giving you the tool to use to learn about directory, finding, you know, brute forcing directories on a website, right? Say for example, you have tryhackme.com slash room, slash vulnerability, right? So how, do we, how would we know that room exists if we only had the top level domain, which is tryhackme.com? We can run GoBuster against tryhackme.com with a word list and see if room exists in that word list, right? So it's pretty, pretty awesome stuff. All right, so you can see the flags here. So it's, it guides you, it's super helpful. And you, know, you keep on going. Next, next section, we're gonna go ahead and compromise the web server, right? So go on, so on and so forth. And you're going to use Burp Suite here, my favorite. And that's an inside joke. But, um, and then you can do some privesque and all that good stuff, right? So it, it's very, very user friendly. Now let's go ahead and jump over to the Red Team certification. So there's something called the Certified Red Team Professional, CRTP. This one is very, very heavy on Active Directory. So let's go ahead and just click on this. So we can have, uh, we can get the certification attacking and defending Active Directory Beginner's Edition. So this is the fancy pat. I mean, this is the fancy uh, certification here. You can look at the syllabus. Let's look at the syllabus. Uh, view syllabus. Okay. So you can see, you know, this this fella here is probably the trainer for here. I never actually done any of their training, but it's something that's on my bucket list that I would like to go. Uh, Go check out at some point. So you have module one, module two, module two, uh, AD enumeration and local privesque, and you know module three, module four, module five probably. So so Nick Hill is the is the is the instructor for this. So yeah, so you guys can check this out. You can watch this little video and you can download the syllabus. So let's download that. So it's a, it's a beginner's friendly, beginner's edition bootcamp. So the objective is here and the course content is here. So there's one, two, three, four, four modules. So that's not, that's not that bad. It's probably obviously in each module, it goes deeper and deeper into these different attacks. But this looks like an awesome, awesome uh, certification to get if you want to get into red teaming. Right, and there is one more, 
let me see if I remember. I think it's CRTO, I believe. The operator, uh, Red Team Ops. So let me see, what is the, yeah, so it's the, the certified Red Team operator. So let's go ahead and click on here. I, I, I don't know who's the actual, uh, uh, do, 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 do. let's go, what is the CRTO? Uh, let's just go back. Let's go back for a second. Oh, it's zero, um, zero point. So zero point is the, is the folks that uh, deliver this certification. So this is another one you can check out. So yeah, there's multiple, multiple ways you can learn about red teaming. I just wanted to jump on this morning to do a little video on how to get into red teaming from a beginner's perspective. And hopefully this has been informative for you guys. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask me. And I thank you so much for viewing.